min. Okay, min, our question number two. How did people communicate and cook in the past? Hmm. Uh, in the past, they communicate by writing letters mm -hmm. and send to the others. Mm -hmm. And for cooking, I think they have to use wood and they have to collect them and burn them up to cook their food to eat. That's true. So there's a lot of work before <laughs> when they want to cook, right? So they need to collect and then burn it up. Thank you so much for your answer, Min. I'll also give you two throaties. Now for our last question, this will be for Fong. Okay, Fong, do you like means of communication and cooking in the past? Why or why not? I think I don't like means of communication and cooking in the past because I think it's not, uh, I think because it's very inconvenient. Mm -hmm. um, That's right. It's very inconvenient. Do you want to uh, add more? I think every time it feels like a waste of time. That is also true, right? Thank you so much, Fong, for your answer. I will give you two stars for that as well, right? So did you see, like what Fong said, it's inconvenient and it will waste a lot of time if we still do the past communication and cooking. Right? So that is our warm up. Now let's move on to unit two. This is still in fashion. We are in lesson seven, speaking. <laughs> so we are going to speak for today's lesson. So here are our objectives. We are going to employ grammar structure past simple tense okay and we are going to acquire speaking strategies talk about yourself so here are our table of contents we have grammar speaking and summary let's start with our grammar okay so in here we have some examples let me put my camera here first Okay, and we are going to read the examples and then complete the rules with words from the box. Okay, so let's start with Min. Min, can you please read our first example? Uh, they listen to the same kind of music. Thank you, Min. So they listened. What about you, Olivia? Please read number two. They didn't understand rock and roll. Okay, they didn't understand rock and roll. Okay, now what about number three? Fong, please read. Uh, what did they wear? Mm, what did they wear? Okay, so these are our three examples. Now, let's try to complete the rules with words from the box. Okay, so I'm going to give you authorization so you can move, move the words. For letter A, it will be for Min. Letter B will be for Olivia. And letter C will be for Fong. Okay, let's go girls. Wow, okay. So let's see our rules for tonight. So we use the past simple to talk about finished actions or finished past actions and states. So anything that is already done or finished, we call them past simple. Okay, so let me take